Previously on Maddie's Glam Life. All right, y'all. So we pulled over on the side of the road, Grand Tunica. And we just chilling. We chilling up until showtime. You ready? I'm so ready. You ready to go home? No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm ready to get my party on. There was this guy here in Memphis that was just walking up to random people and just shooting them. So your girl woke up and was like, honey, I'm shaving my hair off, okay? My curls have been damaged for a little minute. So as y'all can see, my mom is just simply cutting my hair because it was too gunky, okay, with gel and grease and things like that to just shave it off. So she's starting off with this. Now, as you guys will see by the end of this, that it was still uneven. I just simply wanted my hair to be like the same length as my sides, but we worked with it and I was like, you know what? I'll just shave some more off at another time. Um, so this was just so Something that I kind of decided to do on a whim because I was like it's time for me to refresh my hair and to grow it out healthy so don't judge the way that my mama is cutting my hair okay don't judge my mama if you're gonna judge somebody mama judge yours okay um <laughs> but she is just simply just cutting it down to a length as to where I can simply do whatever hairstyle that I want to do with it which I do have a hairstyle in mind hmm Anybody want some hair? This is my hair off of my head, honey. Okay, this is all that she just cut off. Now, let me figure out what the hell I'm going to do with this stuff that's on my head, y'all. Is my camera even focusing? Try that. It won't even focus. Why y'all ain't say nothing, Glam fam? Alright, I just want to know if y'all ready for this hair reveal. Are y'all ready or are y'all not? Da, na, 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 na. I'm sorry, I ain't gonna do all that. Whoop! Here's the haircut, y'all. I'm back to the finger waves. It's kind of cute. Okay, it's giving. It's giving. It's giving. All right, I need to get back up on game on how to do these properly. But I came on here because really quickly, ooh, washed out, honey. I wanted to share with y'all some things that I got from Amazon super quickly. Um, and then I'm going to try to get some videos done for y'all because tomorrow is, y'all please don't tell me my deodorant is embarrassing me today. Please don't do it. Um, tomorrow is show day so I'm going to be focused on that tomorrow. So I really wanted to haul these items really quickly um, just so that I can, you know, move on to something else and they won't be sitting on my floor because y'all know. I will leave stuff sitting for so long like girl if procrastination was a person it would be me I can guarantee you so from Amazon um I think this is a bodysuit I believe that's what this is let me turn the brightness of this down just a little bit well actually that was a lot <laughs> but I believe that this is okay yeah this is a bodysuit. I'm not going to take this one out of the bag because I also got a nude one. And I know for sure that if I take this out of the bag, I'm just going to get makeup on it. So I'm going to share with y'all the nude one instead. But this is a bodysuit. Alright, let me share with y'all this one here. So boom. This is what this looks like. Um, where's the clear straps? Because y'all, I don't see no... I don't see no straps. Okay. Oh, okay, they're in here. All right, the previous bodysuit that I bought like this came with the clear body, uh, the straps attached. So that's why I was kind of confused. But here are the straps. 
man I'm like a different level of washed out bear with me y'all <laughs> here's the straps here like to the point my camera won't even focus and then here is the bodysuit so it's just a cute nude moment um looks like this it's a thong in the back and yeah I have a black one like this and y'all I absolutely love it um, this is great for if you're going somewhere and you need something that's low plunge but also that um, doesn't have super revealing straps this is something that you're going to absolutely love honey um, and also last but not least I already took these out of the package because I was super duper excited about these these are actually makeup brushes you guys and then this makeup brush said you get 32 makeup brushes now I haven't gotten a chance to use these yet but from touching them baby they are so soft and of such high quality let me share this with you guys okay so this is the one that I touched so I'll oh my gosh y'all it is literally so soft so if you're looking for some makeup brushes you definitely want to check these out okay because these are some good quality brushes um as i use them over time i'm gonna let you guys know a little bit more about them but so far so good um and i have a lot of them okay so i can't wait to see how these are um while doing my makeup I'm not going to be annoying and unbox all these, but you guys, I cannot wait to use these. So anyway, I think that was all. What's this? Uh, I guess this is just a, okay, this is a bag for the makeup brushes. Maybe it has stains on it. That's ghetto. It definitely has stains on it. I don't know if y'all can see that, but that's ghetto okay now that i don't like um but yeah so anyways you guys um right quick what i'm about to do is try to get some videos recorded super quickly um because tomorrow is show day and i'm not gonna have really time to record outside of that so i always love to have me a video or two pre-recorded that way i don't have to worry about that baby while i'm on the road so that's what i'm about to do now and yeah i'm gonna check in with y'all in a little bit hopefully again tonight okay hopefully again tonight sunshine i've been waiting sunshine why are you playing with my head So don't let me down I chase away your shadows Away from the crowd I give you my tomorrow Forever now I give my all, I give my all I give you my tomorrow Forever now I'll never bring you sorrow So don't let me down I chase away your shadows So your girl was able to get one video recorded. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and get this video ready for tomorrow because I know that I am not going to have time. I'm going to reply to some emails and guess what y'all? I'm about to rip up officially, officially resign from my job at Amazon. It's official y'all. Your girl is unemployed. I'm just kidding. No, I am rich. I am beautiful. I will have over 500,000 glam stars before the end of next year, okay? I am successful. I am a money magnet, okay? We're speaking success. I want all of my people to stop saying that you're broke, okay? Stop saying that you don't have it. You have it, okay? You got it, okay? What you speak is what comes true, all right? So I don't need Amazon. I don't need Amazon to make money. I can make the same amount plus more that I was making at Amazon at home. So I'm going to need for 
all of my glam fam members to start encouraging themselves but what i'm about to do as y'all can see your girl is on her email i am well i don't want to show y'all all my business but <laughs> i'm about to officially resign okay um they paid me my last check today y'all know i had to use up all my pto because y'all gonna pay me y'all gonna pay me baby and it's just it's time to let it go um i definitely thought that i was gonna be at amazon a lot longer than what i was um but you know god has a plan for me god has a plan for you and that just wasn't the thing for me okay it just wasn't the thing for me um so these are my termination documents right here um please review your termination letter attached to this email your termination and employment documents are available for review um blah 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 this letter confirms the date of voluntary termination of your employment with amazon yes honey so we out of there we out of there um they had this thing where you could like request the phone call and stuff like that but i'm so through with amazon honey i don't want to talk to y'all i don't need to talk to y'all at all okay we is not friends we is not besties so oh, we don't have nothing to do with each other so let me officially sign this view my documents um okay continue We wish you the best on your endeavors. Look, baby, it's going to be good regardless. It's going to be great regardless, okay? I'm flourishing. Life's great. Everything is absolutely beautiful. Okay, I don't know who y'all think y'all talking to. All right, and that's that. My employment at Amazon is officially complete. I gave them two good months. And ev eventually, I'm going to tell y'all exactly why I could not bear working at Amazon. Why it only lasted for two months. Um, and all that good stuff. But y'all going to have to stay tuned for that. Because, honey, the tea, sip, sip, is coming soon. Okay, period. Now I'm going to get this video edited for my glam fam. Okay. All right, because if you're manifesting, you have to put in the work in order to achieve what you're trying to get. Okay, a little bit of a little bit of advice. Okay, a little bit of advice. So, let me get this video edited, and I'm gonna check back in with y'all a little bit later. Alright y'all, so I am getting ready to go. Your girl should be on time today because it is 10.36. So we gonna see how this pans out for you girl because I'm the person that always ends up rushing, okay? I got my hair slicked down. As y'all know, your girl got a little haircut, okay? So hopefully my hair turns out great because I hate bad hair days. I know we all have them and I completely despise them, okay? I hate them with a passion um i did end up opening up all of my makeup brushes so i'm going to use them on today excuse my deodorant i like to let it soak in a little bit and i just got out of the shower so i'm gonna let it soak in before i get on stage so don't mind that don't pay it no mind okay um but i got all of my brushes open so today i'm going to be trying these out i think that this is a set of like 36 brushes so i put the smaller brushes in here and also the bigger brushes so i'm going to check those out with you guys and i also have one my bodysuit um that i was telling you guys about to be honest these straps are kind of uncomfortable but i'm going to try to work with them um at least today if it looks good under my jumpsuit so anyway y'all let me go ahead and get this face together because before you know it it'll be time to go it is currently 10 38 and we're supposed to be leaving up out of here i think at 12 but everybody's supposed to be here at 11 30 so we're gonna see um how that works out for you girl if you guys did not see my previous vlog from last year when we went to the same place that um 
we are going to on today definitely check it out um we're going to greenville mississippi by the way i'm using the real techniques sponges y'all know that i absolutely love these and basically this is going to be my show makeup um i definitely do a lot more on show days so i'm starting off with the laura mercier translucent powder y'all what's so funny is i actually went in the store to get the born this way powder and the lady recommended this powder to me and i was acting like i had never used it before like oh my gosh like what are the benefits of it what are the perks of it and really i had used it all all along but anyway she kept talking so I was trying to see if she knew what she was talking about but first I'm going to start by setting my brows in place and I like to do this so that I can know for sure that my brows will not move um, because this makeup is of course going to be on all day long so you want to make sure that nothing is going to budge nothing is going to move so first I'm going to start with this because this is show makeup you guys this is not regular everyday makeup where you could just throw on something and get out the way this is show makeup and you don't want to look a hot mess when you get off stage so what i'm looking for right now is a spoolie and i could have sworn that this came with a spoolie but i guess not i lost my spoolie i'm not sure where it's at ah my soul okay um i'm just going to use the brush part of this which i hate them and everything because it doesn't give the same effect honey like i need for my eyebrows to be eyebrowing one today okay i ain't got time for no mess ups i ain't got time for my eyebrows to look a mess i want to look like i just stepped out of a barbie doll box okay um so i'm gonna start by brushing my eyebrows and i'm using the rimmel eyebrow pencil in the shade of dark brown and i'm just going to draw my eyebrows on um so y'all know that this is the part where i get really quiet because you know in order to get good eyebrows you have to focus in on them so pause for a second and i'll be right back all right so today i'm going to use the mac 24 hour studio fix concealer this one is in the shade of nc 43 and i just thought about it you guys but this time last year was a very um I would say well I guess I could say strenuous time in my life um I was going through a lot around this time I had experienced my first little heartbreak or whatever and I'm reminded of this because actually this time last year I was like oh my gosh like because my ex he is a musician as well I was like he's gonna be there and blah 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 and you know how you like after when a breakup is fresh it's not time to really be around one another but it's like last year after the breakup it was like we were around each other back to back to back to back because we were booked on shows together this year i don't give a damn okay and it's funny how things change over time i may talk about that relationship in the future because honey it was a whirlwind of bullshit shut your mouth okay um <laughs> it was a lot that went on there and to be honest like it ended in a way that was just honestly it was stupid it was messed up on his end and also like i don't know y'all it was just a messed up situation all around but i'm in a much better place thankfully um and i'm glad that i went through that because it let me know a lot okay it revealed a lot to me about him and it also revealed a lot to me about myself and through that i realized hell this isn't a person that you really want to be with anyway you know what i'm saying um but i just thought about that because he's supposed to be at the show um today and i was like this time last year was rough on the girl okay but the girl made it through so for all of my ladies that are going through it right now um it could be with your significant other it could be with anything just know that all things get better okay um you're not going to stay hurt forever or at least i hope not okay um we all heal and move past things but all of us heal in our own time okay and um it took me a while to get past that situation but when i made it past it i was just like man like you know how when you're deeply in love and quotation marks you can't see past a lot of bs i was able to see past a lot of that you i may mean, not see past it but um really be able to see the red flags okay 
and um, people are different but people aren't that different so it definitely geared me up for the future and of course now y'all I am with exactly who I want to be with <laughs> so everything is just beautiful life's great everything's great um, I'm using number 23 by the way I told y'all I was going to use these brushes but I'm not even telling y'all whatever which ones I'm using um, so like I said if you're going through anything don't fret okay you will make it through um and just continue to be strong just continue to um feel the situation i would say and also um learn the lesson from the situation because if you don't learn the lesson i always tell people you're going to keep experiencing the same thing until you learn the lesson um so you have to feel that pain you have to go through that and y'all god bless my mama because honey she was there for all of the sleepless nights and all the crying and all the tears and I hate hymns and all the extra stuff and y'all my mom really got weighed down emotionally from me even being in that situation um from me being hurt from me being just um down about the situation you know because moms take a lot of the impact all right because you're their baby you know what I'm saying and nobody wants to see their child go through anything like that so I'm just happy to be in a better um, space you guys I know I never really shared that with you guys but that's really like when I took a hiatus last year that was really what I was trying to focus on healing from and let me tell you something I made it okay I made it through I made it through I made it through I made it through y'all so anyway um i just used the number 30 brush and that is this angled um brush here also i kind of want to take a picture so i'm going to try to hurry up why is my camera not letting me be great y'all i'm in a rush well kind of sort of i just said that so that my camera could focus faster but it's really not trying to okay there we go after some slight technical difficulties, there we go. Finally got the camera to focus. Um, but yeah, you will overcome the situation, you guys. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and do my face and makeup and shut up because it's 1047 and before I know it, it'll be 12. And I also want to take some pictures. Um, so, I'm going to try to speed it up right quick. Get this makeup on out the way. And you guys can watch as I do what I do on the day of a show okay because this vlog should be very interesting all right it should be um nice it should be a good video so anyways enjoy keep on watching and if i have anything to say or any special beauty tricks that i want to share with you guys um that i do on stage i will say something else okay by the way i'm using number 21 all right and it's this fluffy blending brush right here okay camera look look I will take you back to Best Buy I promise you I will I mean I'm gonna use this to just blend out that concealer I just put there um by the way before I I was about to say leave before I stop talking this is a very good concealer like it does not move it does not budge like it's just that girl it's that girl okay so if you're looking for a good concealer definitely look into the Mac um, 24 hour smooth wear concealer this is the studio fix version because once it dries honey it's there and it's there to stay until you wipe it off okay and even then it's still hard to get off unless you're removing it with oil okay so this right here is one of the best concealers that I've tried and obviously it's my perfect shade too so blend that out and let's go ahead and start on these eyelids which let me know down below what do you do first I always do my eyebrows my eyes my face I'll put on my lashes and then I'll do my lips okay if you start with your foundation you are different honey I mean because I can never all right I can never I despise starting with my foundation first unless I just really have to fallout is an mf -er. and if you start with your eyes first you don't have to worry about fallout because you can simply wipe it off so anyway, let me finish this up really quickly, you guys, um, and I will share with you guys any extra beauty tips that I have for when I go on stage, okay?
right y'all so I'm pretty much finished with the eyes I had used the morphe 35s sweet oasis palette this is what that looks like I love this palette I love all of the morphe palettes you guys they are something to obsess over and they're very inexpensive so if you don't own a morphe palette definitely check them out at your local Ulta online wherever you can get your hands on one of these get your hands on them okay because they are fantastic and I also use the morphe 9p petal passion palette which I love as well now I have not had this palette that long you guys but y'all look at it okay it's been through the ringer i have used i'm busy and say no more a lot which those are two of my favorite sayings so it makes sense that i've used those two a lot right but you guys this is another one of my favorite palettes and it's just like a great um nude palette for just getting a beautiful eyeshadow look super quickly i have never used this shade i should definitely try to use oh hey um i can never say this word and i'm not even about to try it um but yeah you guys get this palette if you don't have it um what i popped back in for which again excuse the bleh, excuse the deodorant for right now um i'm going to use the i envy iconic collection lashes um these are number three and this is what i'm going to be using on today can you all believe that i've never used a pair of like neat lashes like these are the only lashes that i've ever really used and i'm so satisfied with them like spending 30 dollars on a pair of lashes is not for me and i have some eyeliner stuff right here i guess it's gonna stay right there because it's not about to bother me today you're not about to run my blood pressure up today baby okay um let me get my lash glue and let's pop these on now i'm going to shape these to my eyes so i am going to cut them i always cut them because in my personal opinion whenever you leave your lashes too long um they make your eye water they definitely do if they go too far into your inner corners like let's say for instance if i put this up to my eye Y'all see how far that goes in? If I allowed my lashes to go in that far, they definitely would make my eye water. So, I'm going to cut these so that they can be fitted to my eye. Throw that one away. And, boom. So, these are very simple. Basically, natural. Well, not natural, but very neutral looking lashes. Like, there isn't too much going on. And that's the way I like it. Okay? Let me make my camera focus. Really? okay there we go so this is what these look like let me pop these on really quickly um i will be using the lash xo eyelash adhesive this is from amazon actually my camera won't let me be great um you guys this is almost out and i definitely need some lash glue but i'm thinking about either going back to duo or something like that because baby none of these work for my eyelids anyway they all make my eyelids swell up so might as well go for the one that i actually like right i'm just going to put this on the lash band and i'm going to pop these on i'm going to put quite a bit because remember these have to last all day long okay because they're not coming off under any circumstances not today at least um and i'm going to pop these on And voila lash on gives you an instant eye lift okay beautiful 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 all right you all lashes are on now we're gonna move on to priming the face now this is a very important part of this makeup video because honey you need your face to be primed and primed good so i want more of like a glowy dewy look so i'm going to try my hardest to achieve that on today while still being able to keep my makeup in place and ensuring that it's not slipping and sliding so first i'm going to start off with the mac prep and prime fix plus you guys this is a tried and true I'm going to spray that and I'm just going to let that soak in and soak in good. Now after that dries, I'm going to use the MAC Studio Radiance Moisturizing Illuminating Silky Primer. Now this right here is a fantastic primer. Um, it helps to keep that makeup in place. It helps to keep everything looking nice and smooth. It is a pump, you guys. Um, and I love this. So I'm definitely going to pick up another one of these. But right now we're waiting until 
this fix plus dries and of course that's going to help me to get a dewy look it's also going to help my makeup to stick in place a little bit better y'all know what fix plus does um this stuff right here is so amazing all right um so what i'm going to do is i'm going to apply the mac studio radiance primer I'm not gonna use about that much. Like I said, again, this is showtime, so yeah, and as you all can see, it has kind of a runny consistency. I'm gonna put this all over, like so. And then I'm gonna take that Laura Mercier powder. I'm just gonna use whatever's left over in the cap, and I'm gonna go underneath my eyes. I'm gonna hit these smile lines and go around my nose and right here as well. Um, basically, well, I'm going to hit my chin too because that's an area that gets oily. Really, any area that gets oily and anywhere that can possibly crease. So let's go under these eyes. Boom. And make sure that you get in there and get in there good, okay? Alright. Boom. So, um, that's going to help to kind of keep those areas in place a little bit better. Next, we're going to move on. I'm going to use the MAC Studio Fix Fluid Foundation. This has an SPF of 15, which is great because I'm going to be outside all day. Um, and this is in the shade of NC44. Okay, so this is another great foundation. If you want your foundation to last all day, this is one that you definitely want to try out. Now today, along with this, I'm going to be trying out this brush here. This is the Do Care Number 3. Okay, so... This is the brush that I'm going to be using today in order to get the job done with my foundation and hopefully it works great, okay? Um, so, I'm gonna kinda lift this scarf up just a little bit um, because I hate having like a harsh line like around that area and I'm just going to apply, all right? So, you guys probably know how to apply foundation. I just take a little bit because there's no pump on here. And since I want maximum coverage today, like I want to look flawless, I'm going to use more than I typically use. I'll typically just um, dab my finger on here once and apply it, but I'm going to do a little bit more since, again, this is stage makeup. This is not everyday makeup. This is stage makeup, honey. Let me re-emphasize that. Stage makeup. I'm not trying to look normal. I'm not trying to look like the same person. I'm trying to look like girl. What did you put on your face? I need that in my life. That's what I want to look like, okay? So, there's that applied. Now, what you want to do is you want to take your makeup brush and just push it into the skin. So basically, we're dabbing it. We're not dragging it. We're going to dab it into the skin like this, okay? And that's going to help it to last a little longer, and it's also going to help it to adhere to the skin a little better than what it would if I swiped it, okay? So dab it into the skin like so press 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 all right so there's the foundation all applied flawless you guys so i'm going to use that same matte concealer that i used around my eyebrows and also on my eyelids and i'm also going to use a little bit of the maybelline fit me concealer in the shade of 22. now what i'm using this for is to make this a little bit brighter okay so you guys are going to see um so i'm just going to apply this And like I said, I'm applying more than usual. This is show makeup, not normal makeup for the people in the back. And I'm going to apply a little bit of this to make it just a tad bit brighter than what it is, okay? Now, I'm going to use the MAC Blot Powder. This is in the shade of Medium Dark. And I'm going to use this to set my under eyes into place. So, this is what that looks like. So, let's blend that out. And I'm dabbing this into my under eye, just like I did that foundation. All right, now it's time for that powder. And all that I'm going to do is just dab this into my under eyes. All right, there you go. Super bright, lifted. Um, now I'm going to do this other eye really quickly. And... I'm going to set the rest of my face and that's pretty much all of the makeup tips that I have you guys like in terms of going on stage that's really what I do and my makeup lasts with an S lasts so I can't say with an S for some reason but it lasts all day long and I always get compliments on my makeup so 
yeah um i like to let it sit for just a little bit um and then i'm gonna use that same laura mercier powder in order to set this into place okay all right you guys so my under eyes are all set so that's it for this sponge i won't be using this again in this video um next i'm gonna take my laura mercier powder and do i have a powder brush here I don't really have a brush that I'd like to use for powder here. Okay, well, let's try this one. This is the Do Care number no. 7, since I'm trying to stick with the theme of using these brushes throughout this video. So I'm going to use this brush here, and I'm just going to take it, dab into the powder, tap the excess, blow it, and then dab it into my skin, just like we did that foundation. Now, going on stage, I definitely love to set my face because you guys this keeps everything in place like this seals the deal okay with the makeup so make sure that this is a step that you don't skip especially if you have oily skin all right and my face is set into place it should not be moving it should not be budging it just is what it is okay baby it's her it's her and it's her to stay um so now i'm gonna bronze up really quickly i'm gonna finish up my face and i'll come back and i'll share with you guys my highlighter and my lips all right you guys so today to get that super duper out there glow i'm going to be mixing three highlighters so i'm going to be using max mineralized skin finish and soft and gentle i will also be using max um mineralized skin finish and global glow and last but not least i'm going to add the laura geller gilded honey okay so i'm just going to open these up this one is broken oh my gosh okay open these up and i'm going to apply and I will be using the Do Care number 13 brush, okay, to apply these three items. So you guys, today is probably going to be kind of awkward because actually, um, as I told y'all, my ex-boyfriend is going to be there, but not because of him. Um, one of his, someone who plays in the band with him actually tried to like holler at me and he got cursed out quick, okay? Um, to me, I just felt like, what the hell? Like, that was weird to me. So, y'all, that was back in May. We haven't had any shows together since then. And I was like, ooh, this man is weird. So, I'm going to try to stay away from him. Um, you know, we all artists and entertainers pretty much cross paths. But he's a weirdo, okay? And I really don't give a damn if he's watching. And not to mention, I'm like young enough to be his child like three times over. So... Um, I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty highlighter in Kilowatt. I mean, yeah, in Kilowatt. Um, this is their illuminator. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop this into my inner corners. This is kind of like an icy um, blue shade. So I'm going to pop this into focus. Focus, girl. I'm going to pop this into my inner corners. I hate the way that this highlighter gets like dips in it like that because you guys, I haven't even been using this for a very long. Like, I literally just do this. I hate that okay um all right so i'm just going to apply this to my inner corners and i'm going to finish off with some mac fix plus all right now it's time for the lips so what do i want to do with my lips Okay, I always end up using my eyebrow pencil as a lip liner. So this is the same dark brown um, eyebrow pencil because for whatever reason, I have not bought the right lip liner color that I need. So don't worry about me, sweetheart. Mind your business, okay? I'm going to use the MAC um, lipstick in the shade of Cosmo. This is what that looks like. And if you guys are interested in all the new MAC makeup that I have, check out my MAC makeup haul and that's going to share with you some of the new items that i picked up and am currently loving at this moment and last but not least i'm going to use the nika k 24 carat gold lip gloss this is just a clear um lip gloss all right and boom you guys this is the finished look now let me see what my hair is looking like All right, you guys, here is laid. I don't know what the back looks like, but that's the back. What y'all, what y'all thinking? Y'all like the look? 
Do you like the look? Is it cute? Is it giving the vibes? Let me know down below. Let your girl know down below. Period. Now, let me go put on some clothes, honey. It is now 11.32. Alright y'all, so your girl is ready. I'm going to share with you all a quick OOTD. Alright you guys, so here is the quick outfit of the day. This jumpsuit is from Fashion Nova. I shared it with you guys in one of my most recent Fashion Nova hauls. So if you guys have not seen it, go check it out. These shoes are from Amazon. And I'm giving the girls rainbow realness on today, okay? the vibes the vibes i absolutely love this it fits the body beautifully i'm obsessed honey i'm giving the girls rainbow period okay um one time so far so let me keep it rolling and um, i'm gonna check back in with you guys in a second okay Great. I've been feeling emotional Look at her head. Look at mine. Yeah, that came from my daddy. <laughs> so, 
anyway y'all my eyes won't let me be great my eyes keep watering okay courtesy of her they know her child oh, i don't know the glam fam don't know but my this just face, happened so. though this just happened as i as i get older a lot of things will change Except the body, in case y'all are wondering, I'm still gonna be fine. Yadi, 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 yadi. I'm still gonna be fine. So don't, <laughs> don't get too happy. <laughs> don't get too happy. And I'll tell them. She said, I'm just gonna mind my business. Anyway, y'all, what time is it? 3 52. I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna eat or not. I, I just don't really have no appetite. Like, right before shows, like, I have to eat, like, either on the way here or something like that. So, anyway, but I did bring my camera today, y'all. And I should have brought my camera last time because I would have had some bomb footage because we were damn near stranded. <laughs> I told them I had to do story time. Crazy. Story time. But, anywho, that's that. And they gave us a dressing room, Don, but, not but it's still a peephole. Yeah. Uh, you're waiting it out. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I think these are the shoes I wore last time. That's why they get it all. Oh. Look at my toe; it's doing so good. Look at mine. It's an old fake toenail. Flourishing. I bet y'all won't do bone dye again. Is that what they call it? Short bone dye? And you thought you didn't have my toes. <laughs> no, my toes are prettier than yours. They're just bigger. Your toes only look good because they in that shoe. That's mean, ain't it, y'all? She so said she has some interesting looking feet. They are, oh, y'all forget, y'all are not the beautiful babes. My beautiful babes, no. I have definitely one of a kind feet. We don't, and all the foot pervs out there, don't be going over to her channel talking about your Wait a minute. <laughs> if they do something wrong with them. <laughs> oh, I want to suck your toes. They <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs> Let me move my stuff out of the way. Social experiment. God probably trying to tell you something. <laughs> okay, well, I say you would have did it if I hadn't taken the bomb. When it's empty. <laughs> okay. Alright. I picked up a meal ticket out there on the ground. Like now I got three in my pocket. <laughs> and I don't need them. If I want to be like This ain't gonna work, Mom. It's not gonna work. Oh Lord, she found a little scissors. Don't spill. He had to drink some of it now. It's according to this time. And all you have to do is when you cut here, you see? Oh Lord. You cut here. Couldn't do it. You did that. I told y'all I could do it. I'm a genius. I'm a what? fucking genius. <laughs> oh gosh. I know I am. I'm the only bitch that get booked on shows, pay y'all, and can't sing a lick. Genius. <laughs> I said you can do it. I just wanted, I thought the water was going to work. You're not on camera. So 
Yeah. Now you are. Is that a Yeah. Now wave. Yeah, hold on, hold on. Is that throw up the deuces? Oh Lord. Okay. They go done over there. Alright, I got y'all. Y'all go get my video. You just have to drink your water down a little bit in there. Uh -uh. Lay it on the side, cut it, pop this social up. experience. Just like that. Well, I'm gonna make this my way.
Complete makeup ruined. Mission complete. My eye will not stop watering for the life of me. This is her fault. These are her genetics. What? Wait a minute. Her genetics. Wait a minute. And it shall be passed on for many more generations. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Anyway, waiting on the chicken. Headed back to Memphis. <laughs> 